Grace, are you excited about being here? Mm -hmm. What do you like doing here? Drinking water from the hose. Why do you want to come to the Triple T for summer camp? Because I get to make my own shirt and I get to take care of the garden and I get to see a bunch of deer. All right. You like it here? Uh-huh. We like having you here too. Yeah. Big old dude, yeah. 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 <laughs> Where's my <Mr>. jacket? <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> Potatoes. Snap peas. Onions. Garlic. Mm -mm. Oh man. Sugar snap? Sugar snap peas. How many did you get? Mm. Quite a few of them. Sweet as candy. Cover our see if we got any uh, sugar cane. We put this in here. Was it November? From the syrup festival, I bought some sugar cane. We bedded it down in this cedar, cedar mulch that we got from these trees right here. We knocked down, and we put jalapenos and cayennes on top of it to keep the animals out of it. There's one right there. There's another one. See, can you see it? There's the sprout. So we'll get these in the ground. And maybe by Thanksgiving, when we have everybody over, they can chomp down on them. That one may not, uh, there's one right there. You say it probably ain't gonna make, but it, did. Yeah, it's got a bunch. Look, the roots are coming out on that one. I actually didn't see where he hit. I just saw him. He was she or he was on my table. I guess this is as close as I'm going to get to one drinking out of my hands. Get a drink. Get a drink. Come on. Get a drink. Get a drink. You're going to be okay. What in the world are y'all doing down here? I hope y'all weren't in this uh, mower. You gonna be real quiet now? Harvesting the onions on the Triple T Ranch and sawmill. This is 
May 2019 harvest. Yeah, after that big rain, they need to be dried out, but it's gonna be interesting. We're gonna put them on our weight scale and see what, what kind of poundage we grew here. These were planted in the middle of January and it's now the middle of May. Dead gum, it went around. <laughs> Triple T produce here, let's see where it was. Okay, there's zero, there's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Let's just call it 15 pounds. Cut the tops when they dry and we weigh them. All right, you ready? Okay, there's zero. 10, 12, 13, let's just call it 15 and 13, 28. And then we'll wait again whenever we cut the tops. So when you're putting your onions up, you cut off the stem at an angle and then the roots you snip off. Now. You want these to be dry, see how it's wet? So I like to leave them out in the sun. And then this shrivels up and it just seals it. And you can use these onions for such a long time. But I'm fixing to use these two today with my broccoli. And my snack peas. So these will go in the compost bin. And Grace thinks she can dig them. She's a city girl and we're trying to convert her right now to being a country I see, girl. I already see a potato. Oh my God, they're poking up. So let's see what we got here. See, that's a sticker right there. You keep your hands off of that one. I'll get right here. Put okay, back just a little bit so he doesn't accidentally, accidentally hit you with it. Alright, see if you can find any. Let me get the basket. I already see one that's poking out. Okay, wipe off the dirt a little bit. You start it one way and you work your way down the... the you don't have to do it real clean. Just throw them in there. Throw them in the basket. Or kind of gently send them, send, set them in there. That's a pretty good size one. You know what those are called in Spanish? No. Papa. Uh. Woo, look at those grays. These are good eating right now when they're coming out of the ground like this. There's one stick I guess. That's so a nice far. size. Hold that in your hand, let me look at it. Very good size. That's a big one. Let me see it. Goodness gracious. All right, here we go, Grace. We're gonna weigh all these potatoes. Our potatoes from this little small garden. It's probably <laughs> ten foot by two foot, and it has sawdust, manure, some hay, and some sand. And sawdust. Grace, Grace here, Queen Grace, says thirteen pounds. Uh -huh. And Jackie, camera girl, says thirty. And I say 25, so here we go. Okay, there's zero. There's 10. There's 20. 28. Camera girl was closest. She gets the pudding. Yeah. We don't get to have it, she does. No, we get ice cream instead. I have some bad news for you, though. We get ice cream instead. Now there's some more bad news. Why? We have another potato garden. We do? It's growing in the hay. It's an experiment. So this was grown with a lot of amendments to the soil, but the one we're going to go to next had to just make it on its own. These are wild potatoes. We grew mm -hmm. them. We just threw them under this hay right here, and we're going to see. 
Yep, we're gonna see what kind of produce we got out of it. Some kind of the deer come here, see this? Mm -hmm. The deer ate the leaves off of this several times. So let's see what we got. Stand back. Where? Okay. Got your little worm. He's huge. Mm-hmm. We can go fishing with that. Yeah, I think you tore that one in half, Grace. I did. He's got a half brother now. <laughs> 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 He's got a half brother. <laughs> we had better production alongside the hay right up against it, right? Because mm -hmm. it held moisture. All the rain that came into this hay went right down there to where the potatoes were. And there's more worms. And there's more worms. We got a whole bucket full of earthworms. And potatoes. Okay. A lot less taters here than we're at the other. Sure he is. But still, there's more worms. Yeah. We're going to weigh the potatoes and see who gets the closest. And we're... Here we go. Two, three, four, five. Up. Oh. Seven and a half. I think Uncle Kim won. He said eight. So this is the other, other batch, right? It's a six gallon bucket. You two get the pudding. Yeah. I this get is the, the hay cream. potatoes. I get and look the at that. That's a little praying mantis right there. Oh, isn't he cute? Little baby one. Aww. Let me grab him. I want him. Uh huh. I'll put you with our worm. So there you go. And just kind of shake off the dirt and actually lay them in the grass. Because we're going to, we got to cut them. Get the dirt off of them a little bit. You guys kind of wiggle it to break the roots. Because they're stuck in the ground by yeah. the roots. See, look. See the roots? Yep. There she did it. We're going to weigh the garlic now. Here we go. The basket weighs one pound, so that's why it's already passed it a bit. Okay, there's zero. Seven and three quarter. How many did I say? Nine. What did I say? Eleven. What'd you say? Ten. He <laughs> gets extra pudding tonight. <laughs> no, I get ice cream. He gets ice cream and pudding. I'm gonna empty out the worms into the compost that I picked up. Let me see the worms that you picked. Um, Uncle Kim and me, Uncle Kim and me picked them up. How and many now, you got? But, like about ten there? Yeah. Okay. Throw them in one at a time so we can count. Okay. Let's see. Okay, right here where all that dirt is, right there. Okay. Let's see. Earthworm girl. One. And then 13, 14, 15. One more one there. 15 earthworms. All right. They're going to help our compost. Where'd that gift come from, that present out there? It came from me and mom. Is it for the camera girl, Aunt Jackie? Uh huh. Where's my gift? Your gift is me coming here. What? Yeah. <laughs> There you go. There you go. See him? Yeah. They're hungry. Well, that's plenty. <laughs> They're gonna get full. They're gonna get fat. <laughs> this is Uncle Kim's fish tank. 